Welcome back in the postgame. Uh, Kemper head coach Keith Steckride joining us here tonight. Coach, you got to be very happy. What a performance by your ball club. Yeah, very nice start for us. Um, get some young girls in there. That, you know, those first game getters. I don't even know if we had those first two games. Maybe that third game, but not first two. So it's really nice to see that. A lot of areas of strength uh, for you tonight. What stood out, though, to you? Um, just overall play. I mean, this back row, Sylvie C was excellent tonight. I mean, that's how it starts. Like Sylvie C. And, you know, we missed maybe one or two that I can remember. It's just, that is just the key to it all. Kind of surprised to see this kind of performance this early in the season? Oh, exactly. I mean, you just never know. You get this Carroll game, and it's always went on like, whew, it's over with. Because <laughs> it's just, uh, you know, a lot of, everybody knows everybody, big crowd, and yeah, it's just it's really nice to come out and play this well. Keith, a little confusion going into game two and in game three, so we had a little longer delay there. Did you talk to the girls about staying focused, and what did you say to them? Oh, exactly. I mean, I got Morgan out there. She knows what to do. I always tell them this group up, you know, just talk, never just say some jokes, it doesn't matter what they say, but just, you know, just relax. Keith, uh, service-wise, uh, did you feel like your team served as well as you needed them to tonight? I know the girls said that they had struggled a little bit in some of the scrimmages as of late. Yeah, um, we, you know, our goal is 95% this year, which is a pretty lofty goal, and, you know, I, just on hindsight, without looking at anything in the stats, I think we're right there tonight. I think there's two saves that I can think of that really stood out, but, I know it was more than that, but it was, it was a good Sylvie, I guess. Coach, uh, they were going to come out that tonight. They're trying to play a little faster than they have in the past. How did you feel like your team handled it tonight? Oh, very well. I mean, I just, I mean I'm, I'm excited the way they're going right now. It's, it's the first game, so I can't get too excited because we got a tough one next year. Uh, uh, Red Elk's coming, and it's going to be brutal. Any areas that you could see tonight you feel like your team still needs to get better at? Oh, exactly. Just um, a little bit of like it's more chaotic just to calm down, um, keep the ball in play, keep, stay in system. And, uh, but we also get a lot of times when we save balls too. I thought we did a good job of that chaotic and went back into system. So it's, you know, it's good. Well, Coach, I tell you what, we appreciate you joining us here. We'll talk to you a lot more about this one and the, the upcoming matchup with Red Oak on Saturday for the Coaches Show. Thank you very much and congratulations here tonight. Thanks a lot. Appreciate you. Head coach.